by the folks at the very top in this country, they don't need another champion in Washington. They'll always have a seat at the table. They'll always have access. They'll always have influence. The people who need a champion are the Americans whose letters I read late at night. The men and women I meet on the campaign trail every day. Now the laid off worker who's going back to community college to retrain at the age of 55 for a new career. She needs a champion. The restaurant owner who's got great food but needs a loan to expand after the bank turned him down. He needs a champion. The cooks and the waiters and the cleaning staff at the Madison Hotel trying to save enough to buy a first home or send their kid to college, they need a champion. The auto worker who never thought he'd see the line again and now is back on the job filled with pride and dignity because it's not just building a great car, it's not just about a paycheck, it's about taking pride in what you do. He needs a champion. All those kids in inner cities and small farm towns, the valleys of Ohio, the rolling Virginia hills or in the streets of Madison, kids dreaming of becoming scientists or doctors or engineers or entrepreneurs, diplomats, maybe even a the president. They need a champion. Now's the time to keep pushing forward, to educate all our kids and train all our workers, create new jobs, bring our troops home, care for our veterans, broaden opportunity, grow our middle class, restore our democracy, and make sure that no matter who you are, no matter where you come from, no matter how you started out, no matter what your last name is, you can make it here in America if you try. Yeah.